According to Microsoft, Copilot for Service is a groundbreaking evolution in the portfolio of revolutionizing customer service. And guess what? You don't need Microsoft Dynamics customer service to use it. We are talking about generative AI service experiences that you can use to support your customers no matter the CRM platform. I mean, Copilot for Service is actually a completely different product offering from the rest of its Copilot counterparts. So what exactly is Copilot for Service? Microsoft Copilot for Service is a generative AI capability that can transform service experiences and increase agent productivity in the tools they use every day. Effective customer service is not just about solving customers' problems. It's about creating long-term loyalty, efficiency, and business growth. But there is a hurdle, and that is access to the right data and the right tools. This is where Copilot for Service steps in. Most people understand that customer relationships are important, and I understand that I'm not saying anything groundbreaking by saying that, yet. Most larger organizations have CRM systems in place to help manage these relationships. And developing, deploying, and managing these CRM systems are a huge effort and workload on the companies that use them. Unless you were using Microsoft Dynamics, you were out of luck with Copilot and generative AI capabilities because Copilot alone for most organizations was not a big enough reason to switch CRMs. What if I told you you could implement Copilot into your CRM. Side note, I'm gonna talk about the price of Copilot for Service at the end of this video, and a little spoiler, it's not necessarily cheap, but hey, it's cheaper than a whole CRM. But you are hearing me correctly, Copilot for Service is a product that is built to sit on top of your current CRM without the need to be supported by Microsoft Dynamics. And now you're probably thinking, okay, what platforms does Copilot for Service support? Well, let's answer that by showing you how it works. It synthesizes data from your organization's knowledge sources and guides your agents in real time. And the best part, no need for costly development or replacing existing solutions. It's like giving your current system a boost without the headaches. And it is actually embedded directly where your agents are going to be working, either in the desktop or in Microsoft Teams. Now, Copilot for Service is a part of the Copilot for M365, and they come as a package, meaning organizations can use the broader productivity enhancements that their agents are already familiar with, like Outlook and Teams. For example, Copilot can quickly bring agents up to speed on email threads within Outlook by providing summaries, as well as accelerate responses to customers by providing draft emails. In Teams, agents can stay on top of meetings with customers or subject matter experts by viewing AI-powered meeting recaps with summaries of key discussion points, sentiment, and next steps. Furthermore, agents can use Copilot to get the latest account and case information from CRM systems. Copilot for Service connects effortly to Salesforce, ServiceNow, and Zendesk. Additionally, Copilot for Service can be extended to other systems with more than 1,100 pre-built and custom connectors that eliminate the need for expensive IT integration work. Looking ahead, Copilot for Service is set to enrich email summaries, email drafts, and meeting summaries with your CRM data. Hey, I'm sorry to burst your bubble, but it's now time to talk about pricing. As cool as Copilot for Service is, I think it still comes at a premium. At first glance, you can see that on the Microsoft official page that Copilot for Service is 50 US dollars, which by itself isn't a crazy amount, but Microsoft has snuck this in the fine print. You also need an Office 365 E3 or E5 license, which are $23 per user per month or $38 per user per month, respectively. I understand that a lot of companies may already have these Office 365 licenses, but this is bringing the total cost of Copilot for Service up to either $73 or $88. And again, that's per user per month on top of the licenses they already have for your CRM. I mean, at least after all, Microsoft offers you a discount bringing you down to 20 US dollars if you already have a Copilot for M365 license, which ironically is worth 30 bucks a month. So it's 50 either way. It's certainly up to each individual organization on if this is worth the investment. Microsoft has shared that they use Copilot on their own customer service teams, and this has reduced case resolution times by 12%, which is actually a noticeable bump. So if as an organization, 12% is worth, call it 80 bucks? Well, I guess you have your answer. So crunch some numbers and see if it works for your business or a business that you are working with as a power platform developer. After all, generative AI is changing how we do business and it's changing how you as an employee are getting work done as well. You are gonna have to check out this video to see how.
Thank you guys for sticking with me to the end of the video. My name is Griffin Lickfeld, the host of Citizen Developer, and I'm excited to connect with you guys in the next one.